What's up, Doe Chasers? Today is a beautiful day. It's Tuesday. That means I get a fresh haircut. That means that I'm behind the camera. Um, also, I have some things on my to-do list. Uh, we're revamping witnesswitches.com and I need to hire some bloggers. Uh, so I'm going to uh, get some freelancers to, to set that up. Um, but the tone of witnesswitches.com is changing. Um, it's now going to be a hub for financial information when it comes to budgeting, credit, credit repair, credit building. Uh, I don't know if we're going to add investing just yet. So, you know, you have to be careful with that. Um, but I'm definitely going to get into crypto. Definitely. Um, so I'm excited about that. Uh, but like all things, we have goals that we have set in mind. But the universe has its plan. So whatever happens, I'm going to pivot. It's not going to stop. Me. You feel me? Uh, so I want to thank you for joining me on this journey. And let's do great shit. So, um, this is the home page. Okay. Okay. I'm not done yet, but I'm liking the direction it's going in. Okay. I like what you did to your desk. Sorry. Mm -hmm. Observation. Thank you. Appreciate it. Uh, I should have saw when I was standing up yesterday. <laughs> anyway, um, so we got our header. Okay. Call to action. Join our 14 day money management. I mean, money challenge. You get your paper straight. They click that. <laughs> It takes me here to the 14 day money challenge. Uh, I want to do something freaky with this to show more episodes. Maybe I can put like little videos down there. Mm -hmm. uh, but each time we do a new video, uh, we're going to post it. Okay. Exactly. Feature stories. We can call this something else. I don't know what to call this just yet. But this is basically going to be our blog area. Um, I feel like it may be. Uh, Two, uh, how can I say this? I don't like the list format. How about that? I may put this like bow, 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 yeah. so it doesn't so it doesn't take up too much space, but we get more into that area. Mm -hmm. um, but anyway, this is gonna be our blog section. Okay. Subscribe to our newsletter. You know, because we want people to, you know, we subscribe. Newsletter? Well, newsletter, aka blog. Okay, cool. Yeah. Okay, um, but yeah, I'm thinking about, we had a newsletter before, I think I'm going to bring it back and this be something that I work on. I don't know. I don't know. Okay. I don't know. Um, and then got back credit, let our team of credit experts, our team of experts fix your credit. Um, and then basically it talks about the price and if they click that, it will take them to the, to our credit repair service page. Bam. Uh, I gotta fix this little area because I need that text to be bigger. Uh, but also take ownership of your financial issues and try our courses to get back in the driver's seat. Our online academy is only $19.99 a month. I'll probably add a little bit more information, but they click that, it'll take them to transcendyourfinances.com. Um, check your finances with our new budget planner. Okay. Click that, take in the black letters.com. 
Um, six secrets to raise your credit score to 100 points. Come out the book. Bow. They click that. It will take them to the uh, order page for that. And then Dope Chaser. Let the, let the world know you support us and that you're not playing with, about your money by wearing our apparel. Bow. Click that. It will take them to DopeChaser.com. Um, but yeah, this is basically the gist of it. Hey, I want y'all to know the camera is on. And we're vlogging. Oh, Lord. Vlog, 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 vlog. We're vlogging. Hey, the dudes though that say that uh, two taco things, they must not like this. No, the dudes that say you should only eat two tacos, that's all they can afford. Oh, well, then. <laughs> well, then. I told me that's the status of my own. All I got was two tacos. Why I got a four tacos? taco budget. Four taco budgets around here. Four tacos. And one margarita. Do not get a refill. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, you gotta, you gotta set the precedent first. What's up, boss? What's going on? Took a vacation, came back a little darker. What's going on, man? If I would have hit big, I wouldn't have came back at all. So. Uh, <laughs> I would have counted W's with that one. So you lost money? No, I didn't lose money. I didn't spend it. That's, that's the thing. Okay. I'm not smart. Gotta be smart. Right. All right, so I have something to tell Sean. I'm a little nervous. I have something to tell you. What? Just tell me. No, I can't tell you. I have to actually show you. Um. In like 30 seconds, come to my office. I'll put it 45. Okay, I appreciate that. <laughs> hey, Sandy. I told him. He's going to come in like 45 seconds. This is a surprise for you all, too. Um, trying to take my marketing game to the next level. And I'm taking a risk. Um, and I'm going to give you a sneak peek of that risk in a moment, okay? You're going to love it. No, I'm not talking about it. What you mean? What you I need you to put these headphones on, bro. Right here. Oh, you track? Right here. My hair, my hair is blocking it, Drew. All right, so first and foremost, I need you to understand that this is a demo. This is a demo. Okay? Um, don't judge me too harshly. But the point of me sharing this with you is to let me know if I should go through with it. If it's hot or not, that's okay. what you're asking me. Um, some of my bars I'm going to redo, but <laughs> let me know what you think. All right, y'all. Here it goes. Hit or miss. Reaction. Live and direct. Hit or miss. You won't hurt my feelings, okay? Because I have a reference. All right. You ready? Mm-hmm. Y'all boys really out here thinking you're doing something. Here. Y'all just playing the game and losing. Let me see if I can teach you a little something. Let's get it. They chase designer, I'm a dough chaser. They chase designer, I'm a dough chaser. Yes. Keep acting like money is the goal. I put it to work and watch the money grow. They chase designer, I'm a dough chaser. They chase designer, I'm a dough chaser. Yes. Keep acting like money is the goal. I put it to work and watch the money grow. The future is vivid. Stack it by the millions. Pocket the profit and invest in my children. Unc said, do it for the pension. Work for the government, but I didn't listen. I went all in, straight commission. Can't accept the wage, ownership's the mission. Perfected progression, struggled into winning all. Hustle, no luck, like Jordan Pippen. Almost gave it up, but I saw the bigger picture. Stick to the plan, reinvest and get richer. Saw my worth, started paying me first. Put the brand to work, increased my net worth. Thought it was over when I lost a hundred grand. Got it right back, now they calling me the man. A dollar and a dream was my safest bet. Now I'm a boss, all I do is write checks, yeah. They chase designer, I'm a doge. <laughs> uh, what you think? First of all, that don't sound like you. You could have definitely told me that my little cousin made this song okay, for okay. me. That shit. That's cool. That's cool. Uh, I like it, but I feel like it's slow. I feel like you're saying it versus like rapping it. Well, yeah, sense. I made it so literally. Um, I wrote it Saturday night. Yeah. Finished it 
Sunday morning. We should have record it on right here. Oh. And wrapped it that night. So I literally wrote it like twenty four yeah, so hours. Yeah, you should use that as a reference track. It's a demo. Yeah, it's a, it's a <laughs> good demo. demo. It's a great start because it's like a couple of words we're using the oh, wrong words yeah, right. like that. Yeah. But, and I just feel like you just gotta wrap it, give you a little more flavor. Exactly. Feel like you gotta let me get this on wax exactly. and now put your sauce on it. I like it though. Okay. So I like the hook. So we passed the test. I need some more beat in that bitch though. Like what I mean, like that bitch supposed to be like do 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 do. Well, it it's does like, do that. It's just. Is it the phone? I don't know how to. Head? I don't know how to edit the shit in, in this. So I worked with what I had. You feel yeah. me? Yeah. I like but it. But it actually, it actually is a hard beat. No, I like it. I like it a lot. Right. Like I said, you just you gotta get some more sauce because like your second verse, you really just like. I feel like you was you reading it, bro. I I was reading all of it. Yeah, yeah. I can tell in the second verse. All right. So I feel like look, the we get like that rum. <laughs> record that shit. You need a studio session. That's what you need. That's what I'm saying. So you need that. look, bro. So you agree that it's it's cool enough to actually make it into a real song? Yes, I would make it into a real song, especially because the hook is. I mean, every hook is fucking like that these days, right. and everybody wants a bullshit designer. On fair got more belts just to say they pants. Stupid as fuck, but right. yes. And we talk about all the time who spend all this money and don't got shit right. at home. <laughs> like, so yeah, make a real song, get it mastered, and then we'll make a video. Yeah. And then in the video, we promote nothing but dope chasing shit. Yeah, the video to be wild as <laughs> shit. Like, all right, cool. Big all ass right. phone party. You got a phone machine? My cousin does. We should definitely do a foam party. I mean, just buy like a plastic pool and just. No, he has a, a foam blaster. Oh, like so we can be, uh, yeah. So we can just be. And it shoots for hours. Yeah, we need to just shoot a foam, big foam party video. Cool. And then some bank shots, some shots walking past designer in the mall. I don't <laughs> need that shit. Uh, need that we can. I appreciate. I appreciate that. So we passed the test. So earlier today, I made a post on my Twitter profile. Um, if you're not following me, follow me at Witness Riches. Anyway, um, I basically said that the reason you're not making a breakthrough is because of your mindset. For my credit repair clients, some of them, their issue is credit card debt. And that's the reason that they're not seeing the results they want with their credit score. They understand this, but they have goals of getting a house Buying their dream house, not just getting the house, getting the dream house, the forever house in the next three to six months. But at the same time, they will, not all of them, but some of them, and, and they know who, who I'm talking about. They have this goal of getting that house in three to six months. They understand that they have this credit issue where they keep piling debt on their credit cards and it's hurting their credit utilization. But at the same time, they went ahead and put a vacation on their credit card. So they're adding more debt to their credit card, which is hurting their credit utilization more, which causes the credit score to suffer even more, but they have a goal of buying a house in the next three to six months. And a lot of you, you fall into the same cycle. You have goals for yourself, but your mindset is preventing you from making those happen because you keep thinking the same way. And the way you're thinking is causing you to keep making these same minor mistakes. You cannot have, in this example, your cake and eat it too. Not that way you can't. And what you have to do is you have to sacrifice the temporary want, the temporary desire for the long-term goal. Otherwise, you'll never reach that long-term goal. Hey, somebody had to say it. That boy, Icy. One thing I'm learning is it's okay to recycle mm -hmm. because I don't have a huge audience. Now, if I have millions upon millions of followers, mm -hmm. yeah, people don't want to see the same shit. But the fact that we don't have such a huge following we can recycle and post it in another way because people haven't seen this message. Right. And the average person is not going to scroll all the way down to look at your whole IG. They'll probably look at like, you know, two weeks worth. 
-hmm. But they're, they're not gonna look at the whole year. You know? Mm -hmm. It's just if we do recycle, we get rid of it. Like, I just used this picture today. Style. Gotta get rid of it. Delete. Because I just used it. <laughs> Got you. But yeah, we have to provide value. Because it's all about keeping people on the actual app. Mm -hmm. um, which is why I want to start uploading. I want to start doing this a little bit more. The clips that I was talking about. Mm -hmm. Doing this. I had great too. engagement on the, on these videos. The little quick clips. Mm -hmm. I'm going to start doing those a little bit more. Um, I'm going to work on something today. From Dolce to TV? Yeah. Yeah, upload them because it's all about keeping people on the app mm -hmm. and then through our stories once we get to that part we can sell it in the stories sounds good because you don't want to just keep being in front of the camera like this is what you need to do yeah because after a while that'll get boring it'll get boring though okay here go another Jason White video right I want to change it up but I like the direction that like that you're taking things like in your own like kind of way. Like I feel like, like although, like I'm looking at just some of the stuff you're browsing over. Mm -hmm. Like I've seen like other people have done just like regular videos. Like you're actually creating like movie scenes, like which is completely different. Right. And I think that uh really like attract more attention. Yeah, I agree. Yeah. Um, but we're gonna we're gonna see. <laughs> We're gonna see. No, I'm just saying, I think that separates you from everybody else. I feel like you see this, you know what I'm saying? Like right. the random talk videos or whatever, like you're actually getting creative and creating like movie scenes that nobody else is probably doing. Oh yeah, I mean, they're gonna watch this video. And... <laughs> creating characters. <laughs> I mean, you got the fresh cut today. Should we be taking like photos tomorrow too? Different things you can use with your yeah, yeah, definitely. Your other pose. <laughs> you know, we gotta take not, advantage when you yeah, get the I know, fresh I'm cut. You gotta get the pictures I out. I'm not good at taking pictures. <laughs> My wife, she be like, hey, come on. <laughs> this is not you in this photo right now. I'll be like, <laughs> she was, I look back at it, I was like, <laughs> that's funny. Embarrassing. I'm gonna post that picture too. So <laughs> for my catalog now taking pictures is the hardest thing because you have to get into this like mindset where you kind of like not, not necessarily raping but making love to the camera that's nah. weird for me i can't do that <laughs> making love to the making camera making love because you gotta look at it like it's like you're modeling right yeah well not just modeling but you know i could be like this and a model, but no, nah, people, they're not gonna like that. So I have to like, kind of change who I am. Like, yeah. I don't like that. But you know, that's what separates the models from just people who take pictures. Right. They do actually that's one thing the I'm, camera. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> that's one thing I'm not, I'm not that good at is, but then my wife, she, she threw me a curveball. She's like, you talking about being an actor one day. <laughs> You better put that actor face on That's or you're going to be the one they're making fun of in the movies. <laughs> I'm like, shit. I'm trying to be Idris Alba. Oh, sure. You got a long way to go. You got a long way to go. <laughs> See how she just dissed me? Real nicely, though. Oh, yeah. You got a long way to go. <laughs> it's all good. People keep making the same dumbass mistake because they don't understand that how they think about it is what's causing them to continue to live this cycle. Right. But I feel like if we made videos like that, one, it's gonna really help our clients, mm -hmm. but two, it's also gonna, you know, get to our audience that this is what is separating you from your goals. Yeah. Is the way you think. And then we can come up with like scenarios, um, you know, stuff like that. Okay. Have fun with it. No. Like if I had a hundred, if you had a hundred dollars, what would you do to make this two hundred? Right. Some shit like that. 
and then we would just like provide like you would show them what they can do with that well, i'll just talk about it or just talk about it okay. talk about it i wouldn't necessarily uh, that was a terrible uh idea <laughs> to be honest um, I was thinking like, okay, where would you actually go with that one? I was trying to flip that bitch. Right. So, shit, we make some t-shirts. There you go. That's right. But no, I don't want it to be, uh, I don't want it to be tactics. I just want it to be mentality. Gotcha. Yeah. Like, instead of going and buy a pair of shoes or buy something like you could take this money and yeah yeah instead of saying hey go do this i'll say you need to think about what can i do to flip this mm -hmm. not necessarily go do this but think about ways to flip it gotcha the average person they get this one hundred dollars and then what they want to do is they want to go spend it and go buy some toys or some shit. Like, i was dealing with my daughter yesterday my daughter i was just looking at her all yesterday all right next door neighbor he just had a birthday and he turned five. Okay. okay. So these are kids. My daughter, she's seven. Mm -hmm. I gave him 20 bucks. Mm. And I asked him, like, what did you do with that $20? He said, I don't know. Spent it. He doesn't even remember what he spent it on. Oh. Nine times out of ten, nine times out of ten, his mom took the money and oh, yeah, did true. whatever she had to do, which is cool because um, it benefits him. So I'm not tripping. But my daughter was like, you spent it. Why did you save it? Okay. Okay, Jason. I was like, uh. <laughs> like, y'all hear what she just said? <laughs> um, and I can't wait to teach them how to actually put that money to work. Yeah. Yeah. Because they understand we don't need to spend this. We already have toys. Mm -hmm. Like, what, mm -hmm. what do I need to buy right now? Right, exactly. No, that's really good. And they put it up. They put it in their piggy bank. My daughter, her piggy bank is, it can't fit any more money. Awesome. To say that's how I'm just like my son. Yeah, so it's dope. Um, but it's just going to the next level. And we started in the mind. Like I used to talk to him all the time, like, why do you need to spend this money? What are yeah. you gonna buy? Literally, an example, I gave somebody twenty bucks, he doesn't even remember what he bought. So obviously it wasn't that important. Right, exactly. If it's not if it's not that important, then put it away. I feel like I'm doing the same thing with my son except for somehow I missed the mark with him because he will save his money, but he don't want to spend his money. So I'll be like, well, you got a couple dollars in your wallet. Well, we're going to use your money to buy this today or something like that. Just like joking with him. He'll be like, no, we're going to spend your money. I want to save my money. Right, no, but that's, there's a lesson in that because he can get good at spending other people's money. Right, exactly. That's all credit yeah, is, is spending other true. people's money. No, that was true. Yeah. You're like, why well, I spend my money? I'm about to spend your shit. Right, that's what he be like. No, we can just spend You didn't miss the mark on him. You got it? I'm going to keep mine. We're going to spend yours. Right, right. He just got to be more, uh, a little clever with it and come up with a good reason on why not to spend Oh, you know, I'm saving up for something to get you mine. Right, exactly. Did you hear what Chris said about what they already do on the Discord? You want to hear? What's up? So, a guy and a girl break up. She's still living in an apartment and she still thinks, even though she got a new boyfriend, the old boyfriend should still pay her bills. And he doing it. Who Chris is? No. Oh, guy. oh my bad. I I wish you, no, say. you should have you should have turned it around so you could have got your face. <laughs> 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 so you could have got your face. But no, I was saying this is gonna be juicy. It started at nine, so let me get my tacos ready. I said, you know, I live a boring life, but this is juicy. Okay, so what is it? Is it his show? Who show is it's it? It's someone's show. He's the um. He's gonna be the moderator today. Chris is. Yep. He just put it in a group so we. If if you got time, you can watch it. I'm gonna oh, watch it. Oh my goodness, that's gonna be crazy. And the girl's a Instagram and OnlyFans model. Oh, so she's gonna be there. Yes. Oh my goodness. I need you to turn around so you can show your face. <laughs> oh my goodness. <laughs> oh my goodness. <laughs> yes. All right, y'all have fun with that. I'll. I'll uh, yeah. I'll I may check that out. Yeah, you, it's gonna be good. My wife and I will will tune in tonight and check that out. She'll be she'll be there, and the guy, both guys will be there because our new boyfriend don't like it. Oh, turn it around so you can show your face. <laughs> see now, do you see what I'm saying? What I'm saying? Oh, okay, I that's got you. boring compared okay. to my life. You know, that's boring compared to mine too. <laughs> see. So the day is coming to an end. It's been a great one. Got a lot done. Made some plans. Executed. Make some more plans, execute it. So let me leave you with this final thought. 
Leave nothing to chance. Create a plan and execute. Your future self will thank you for it. See y'all in the next video. Bye.